one of the areas that we focus in is education, specifically communication skills and analytical thinking and higher order thinking skills mm -hmm. among school-based learners. And that's the area that, that I head up. So we are looking at interesting projects, technology-based projects mostly, that support teaching and learning um, of these skills. For me, what's, what's, what's been interesting is how, how much gaming has come into the, into the learning space um, and the Learning and Teaching Scotland projects mm -hmm. uh, initiative that uses the Dr. Kawashima's brain training. And how, what's interesting is, is getting gaming endorsed by a Department of Education and it's showing interesting and, and positive results. So that's, that's been good. Mm -hmm. um, and also how, well my, my observation from MLearn was that you still get people that focus on here's the device, what can we, let's, let's do something interesting with it. It's kind of techies creating projects mm -hmm. um, for kind of project's sake. But the really interesting stuff is more saying, well, what do learners want to do? What do teachers, what are the out learning outcomes they need? And what are some of the, the spaces that the mm -hmm. kids occupy? And let's look, let's work backwards from there. Mm -hmm. um, and how mobile is, is much more than just the device. It's kind of, it's plugging into the home, the school, mm -hmm. the friendship circles, and kind of understanding that.